there. Hey, do you get into trouble for sticking things on your bedroom wall in case you ruin the wallpaper? Well, why not tear the wallpaper apart and stick it to the brick wall underneath? <laughs> Only joking. Take a closer look. This is my hole in the wallpaper notice board. Come and have a look at this. Now, to make a hole in the wallpaper notice board, you need to cut a big piece of cardboard box card, as big as you can get, and it doesn't need to be neat or anything around the edges. And to turn this into a brick wall, we're going to print on it using a rectangle of old sponge, or you could cut a brick-shaped piece of cardboard box card. That's good for printing with. I'm actually going to use an old washing up sponge. See that? Now, you need to mix some poster paint or acrylic paint into a nice ready brick colour, so a bit of red and brown. Dip your sponge in and then just print it onto your cardboard box like that. If you're using a small sponge like this, you may need to just move it along a bit and print it again to get the right brick size. And then continue with a row of bricks along your card, but don't forget to leave a gap of about one centimetre for the mortar. And when you get to the end of the row, you go onto the next row of bricks, don't do the bricks one underneath each other, just slightly offset them like this so that you've got a brick under a line of mortar. See that? Just printing it under that line of mortar, just slightly move it along. And when you've covered the whole of your cardboard box card in your print, you'll have something that looks like that. Look at that. And see what I've done here? I've got my brick wall with all the rows slightly offset. Now, to create the torn wallpaper effect, take some glue and just put a thin strip of glue along the top and the bottom of your cardboard wall, like that, and then just cut some strips of drawing paper or even old wallpaper if you want to, and just line them up with the bottom and the top of your cardboard wall and stick them down into the glue, like that, and then put a thin strip of glue down the side there and there, and again, Put two strips of paper in. These strips are about 15 centimetres wide. You don't need them any bigger than that. Just press them into the glue and leave them to dry. And when the glue has dried, those paper strips are stuck round just around the edges. See that? They're stuck down around the edges. Now, to create the ragged, torn wallpaper effect, it's simple. You just tear the wallpaper into sort of jagged, edged shark's teeth there like that. See that there? Here you've got a sort of jagged shark's tooth effect and then just crinkle it up and bend it back on itself like that. I'll show you another one there. Again, you just tear it down the edge. No need to be neat with this. Just create a sort of jagged triangle effect or shark's tooth like that and then just crumple it up and bend it back on itself and go around all of the paper around the edge your cardboard wall in the same way. Look at all those jagged shark's teeth there. They look like the wallpaper has been ripped and you've got the brick wall shining through the middle there, like that. Then you use it to just pin or sticky tack all your notices, your photographs, your notes too. And there it is. There's your hole in the wallpaper notice board. And you just put a piece of string on the back, just tape it on and then hang it up on your bedroom wall. And no one can say that you've ruined your wallpaper by sticking things to it because you've stuck them to the brick wall instead. <laughs> Try it yourself. A hole in the wallpaper notice board. Brilliant! Simply brilliant! Oh, hello. It's me, The Head. Now, to make one of those, remember, it all starts with a big piece of cardboard box card. Mix some paint and use an old sponge or piece of card to print brick shapes onto it. Leave little gaps between each printed brick. When your brick wall has dried, stick strips of white paper around the edges. Tear the paper so it looks jagged and scrunch it back. When you've done all the way round, you'll have a hole in the wallpaper notice board, ready to pin all your pictures, pop stars, notes and photos on, oh, to keep you up to date. Yes!